What's up Philippines, Luzon, Visayas, and Mindanao, and all throughout the world. This vlog is for you, brought to you by Sir Chad Farmer, ang gurong magsasaka. And if you are new to this channel, the farmers, please don't forget to subscribe and like in order for you to be notified with our coming videos. Thank you and enjoy this vlog. Okay, the farmers, so uh, our vlog for today is all about uh, how to plant ginger in a recycled or a DIY drum of water okay so since our drum of water has been broken so we are going to use this one we're going to customize as our path in planting ginger so let's go kaparmers okay kaparmers so in planting gingers uh, we need some materials and the materials are the following okay kaparmers so these are the materials that we need in order for us to plant the ginger in uh, the DIY or the customized uh, water drum that is already broken so first thing is we have the soil this one so our soil actually uh, this is a uh, hundred percent um dung of a cow which is stored two years okay ago in our uh, storage site so this is already a very very nice uh, soil okay it's full of nutrients and vitamins that is needed in our uh, ginger and the next uh, material ka farmer are the broken drums that we are going to customize as our pot in planting the ginger so this one okay so we put uh, holes already there so that the water will not be uh, stagnant okay so meaning if we are going to the water the, the water will just uh, drain okay and then the last one is of course the ginger okay okay these are the gingers the farmers our uh, bini okay those are the things that we need so let's go farmers okay so in planting this one the farmers we are going to transfer the soil into the uh, recycled drum okay so let's transfer this one okay the farmers so we are done uh, transferring the soil into our uh, recycled drum of water as our pot in planting the ginger so this is already uh, ready for planting the farmers so we have this one in putting the soil caparmers uh, just uh, make it sure uh, the level of soil is around uh, three-fourth of the drum okay do not fill the drum full okay like that so three-fourth of the drum should be filled with water I mean I'm sorry but filled with soil okay do not uh, fill this one with 100% soil because as the gingers grow we are going to add more soil okay okay farmer so the next thing to do is to plant our ginger so how we plant the ginger farmers okay farmers so we have our uh, ginger no ito yung binhi natin our mother ginger so i cut this one uh, according to right sizes okay so this one but there are some other uh, farmers who are cut this one halfway pa rin in order to save uh, the ginger but for me I cut this big in order for us to make sure that our ginger will be alive okay so we are going to plant uh, three ginger in each drum so we will transfer this one here this one and this one okay so in preparation of the ginger caparmers uh, if you are going to buy uh, uh, ginger yung binhi in the market uh, please choose those gingers that are healthy okay and then after buying that one when you go home uh, do not um, directly 
uh, plant that one ka farmers because it might die so you have to store that one inside a plastic or in a sack for uh, one to two weeks okay in order to give rice of the, the sprout like this one it's an eye okay there's already an eye in this one okay so this one because that will be the point of sprout okay meaning if the ginger hatch is uh, the eye is already there then it can sprout easily like this one you have the eye and the eye and this one so it's easy to sprout after two weeks you can see the sprout okay okay caparmers so let's plant this one so in planting this one caparmers uh, please observe proper distancing <laughs> it's like pandemic but proper distancing like this one okay since it is a drum so we cannot have uh, 12 inches maybe it is around 8 it's okay but for basic it's 12 inches from each other okay so and then to plant this one kapermers we're going to dig like this one mga around 1 inch you have to borrow this one in 1 inch okay then just cover okay like that and just simply cover the soil okay like that that simple farmers okay this one will cover this one with soil around one inch yung lalim okay We'll cover and then this one we'll cover okay so it's done kaparmers and then the next thing we need to do is to uh, transfer this one into our area so that is our area kaparmers the one that has a net so let's go okay kaparmer so our gingers has been transferred here in the site okay so i have uh, gingers that is planted also in uh, used sack okay sack so okay that one that is already one month kaparmer very healthy but there are some uh, to whom I replanted it's because uh, during the time I was not able to put net uh, all uh, our chickens are actually trying to uh, kinaikai nila yung sako so what happened the gingers uh, natapon mga kaparmers so namatay so that's why I replanted okay but this one kaparmers you can see there is already a uh, uh, single sprout this uh, variety of ginger is actually the the violet one or yung tapol na luya okay okay so we are going to since it was transferred already to farmers we are going to put uh, malt on this one so i'm going to use a risal for this one okay so wait for a moment okay there you are the farmers i already put uh, risals in our ginger so it will serve as uh, malt so it's mulching in order to control weeds somehow okay so next we're going to uh, water the ginger okay kaparmer so we're going to water our ginger using this uh, sprinkler okay so let's go uh, we're only going to water a little kaparmers so that our gingers will not drown <laughs> okay like that okay and this one and also that okay ok 
Okay. There you go, Kaparma. It's done. So, uh, we'll just uh, give an update for this one after two weeks or three weeks. So, we can see if the gingers successfully grow. So, we can know if the gingers successfully grow because we can see the sprout in this part. Okay. So, that's all for today, Kaparmers. And then, thank you for watching. I hope you have gained knowledge on how to plant ginger even in a sack or in a do-it-yourself or customized broken drum soup water as a pot okay thank you once again this is Serge the farmer Anguro Magsasaka would say happy farming and god bless